we I actually this is my first recording uh, since starting I can't believe the height that we've gained uh, in this time since starting I think today one must make a point of showing some of the flowers here those flowers the only reason I actually I was going to record considerably further up first but now look at the clouds there at the top just when we started it was totally open but I know the clouds here in this mountain now it became cloudy at the top and covered and by the time we get there it might be gone or for all you know it may disappear and then become cloudy before we at the top again for the second time and then clear by the time we're at the top otherwise we're gonna have some nice cool mist further towards the top a little bit later but boy it's that time of the year springtime I can't believe that we've already reached the picnic spot well I've adopted it the picnic spot and it seems like many other people are willing to call it that too this one here is the one that goes uh, we, did, we must do it again one day goes to the old dam and it's an optional route as opposed to the level one at the bottom then we've got this which is what we're gonna do now that goes up to the top uh, all the way along the crest at the top but we've got some nice cloudiness it comes and goes and we just wait and see if it clears up and if it stays like this it doesn't matter to me because it's nice and f it's cool it doesn't really matter that much to me then there's another trail here and this is called Farnkloof or Tunnelbos which is this one look at those kind of pretty ears there so what we're going to do which we haven't done before is we're going to go up here all along the crest at the top and then come sharply down on the other side there and then meet up with Tunnelbos and come back with it which then makes it a, a circle but in other words basically a circle around here and then down back down the way that we came now but look at this here man this these deserve some photos there's plenty of them suddenly and there haven't been any so far look at this lots and lots of them I remember one guy it's been so long since he's joined us and he said he loves the parts where I focus more deeper into the actual flowers man that deserves a photo or two We've had two or three sections like this. Yeah, you've got this rope. But this is maybe the more trickier one. You can see that people have opted for different different options here before. I'm taking this one with the outer rope here. And then uh, and there, and there, and there, quick over, yeah, this does not do justice to the steepness here, but the good news is that we're very close to the top, very close, look the ropes here, may as well use it, eh? may as well use it, but on the other hand, I never know how much faith to put in a rope if it's been here so long. Let's see what's been holding it up here. It looks, uh, that's loose, but that looks sturdy. That looks sturdy. Another oh, 10 meters and we'll be at the top here. We're at 
this particular top you just wouldn't know it yeah no you can see it you can see it see part of the other side there if one comes this side here and uh, yeah I'm out of breath eh? there you can see part of that section of the mountain but all of this here is overcast although I do have a feeling that it's gonna clear up now now clearly we're above most of the clouds or fogginess whatever you want to call it but at least we finally at this crest here I've uh, walked a bit ahead admittedly from the rest of the crew I want to see the expression at least two of them I want to see the expression when they get to the top here because they haven't done this trail before I'm sure they will like it it's just now would be the perfect time for the weather to clear up because it's kept us nice and cool all the way to the top but if it could clear up now to have views would that not be perfect eh? see what happens now I am AI just taking a rest here there's a, at the there's a girl. crest that we met wait a uh, melt just wait oh, and yeah sitting on the rocks here and there's Adrian and Janine there's there's the trail where we came up made it up here and then we're going to be going all along but all along the edge there like that there but let's just take a little bit of a rest and the obvious place to have breakfast is uh, there at the Ovang but we're all waiting and just seeing is this weather going to remain like this there's pros and cons it's cool if it stays like this when you're in the clouds here and the only disadvantage is for the two that haven't done it yet the three that haven't been on it yet is that they're not seeing the full overview around this but I think they're going to be able to see it now now Misty, yeah. You see what I mean about a cross between a cave and like a large overhang? Well, this is not really a cave. This is not going into. This is not like Kanga Caves, it's an overhang. Let's call it a cave to make it sound dramatic. Could we make a fire? Yeah. Could if we wanted to. Let's make it. That's what well, that looks like a mattress there, Milt. Looks like a mattress somebody's yeah. left there. Yeah. No man, they must pack it back inside, unless it's extras. No man. Even if it is extra. Yeah. So even like that becomes litter. Yeah. No man. Smell the fire. Please tell me that it's not stuff from a. Oh, really? Uh, unfortunately, this is becoming ever so more and more popular. 20 to 12, and we're at the highest point. Came up to the top of this uh, hill, which is basically above the cave. Now that I haven't, this I haven't done for the first time in ages. It's only once, once that I came up to the top and went down on this optional route that we're going to be doing today, which is what makes it a bit different from the previous rounds. 
it, I remember it being incredibly, incredibly uh, steep. So I'm waiting to see. It will be interesting to see how steep it is. Uh, it won't be dangerous if you're cautious, because it's not wet today, so it won't be muddy. We'll have a look and see. This may not look like much on the camera, but this year that you're about to see is where the uh, trail we've been taking coming down, the optional trail that we've been coming down on from uh, 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 Van Dalen's Peak at the top there, where it meets up. We just came down there and then it meets up with Tonnelbos, yeah, which we've done before. Very easy to miss this actually when you if you intend to come up on this side, it's very easy to miss it because there's no sign. You've got to know where about to look out for it. So anyway, it may not look like much on the on the camera, but it's a pretty significant point at least. That's what makes this top section a circle today, which is different. We haven't done that before. <laughs> Back at this picnic spot because we've done a, a loop now right to the top, down the other side, and now we've come back this way. Now we're back here again. As you may recall, you may or may not recall from earlier, this is the one that goes to the old dam. This is where we went up sharply, loop, and then came here. We came, did loop, and then came back with this one, and now going back down there towards the bottom always a nice spot to have a quick drink break or even a snack or something here yeah. we're not far from the bottom railway line i hope you've enjoyed this today it's been advantages and disadvantages of having the fog fogginess cloudiness mistiness call it what you like it's made it nice and perfect like uh temperature weather but only disadvantage maybe just not having the view especially for the sake of one or two or three that haven't been at the top there but that's not the end of the world certainly you could see the cave and so on and we haven't done this particular option before which we now have today so there are many days where there's always a first for something so anyway thanks for joining uh, we'll contemplate on what to do next Sunday there's bound to be something and see, see you soon.